All right, as you can see, I've uh, taken the other jack shaft apart. <laughs> there's the there's the sprockets. I'm gonna go disassemble this bearing, okay? So uh, I'm just gonna shoot a quick accelerated video of me removing it, okay? Uh, I think these bearings are worse than the ones that I just took out too. Okay, I got them out, but uh, <laughs> so I messed up. I I didn't I didn't double check to make sure which side was the double bearing side, and I tried to push the side with the double bearings out first. Okay, and it came out like kind of crooked, you know. So make sure if you're gonna take the bearings out, take the one with the single bearing side out first. Okay, because that that happened to it. Okay, <laughs> that and that. So that bearing is toast. Like I destroyed it. Um, Twenty ton press, man. That's what happens. Hey, there's one of the bearings. Oh, these are, these are, never mind, these are brand new bearings. No, 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 these aren't the brand new bearings. Why is it that I have four bearings? Oh, oh, there's four bearings. Uh, all right, guys, uh, so uh, Discovery, um, this, new ja this new jack shaft that I have, it takes four bearings, not three bearings, okay? I took four bearings out of this thing. Okay? There's the broken one and then the three here. So there's a it's a double bearing on both sides. So they updated the design. They put two bearings on uh, each side. This uh, this one looks perfectly good. This one This one sounds good too. This one's a little gritty. Yeah, I don't know, man. So, I don't know. This one we can't check because I broke it, so... <laughs> but yeah, the new one is has four bearings in it. That's why it looked different than the other one. So, the, so here's the... Uh, 
here's my stock one, okay? This is from a Suron uh, MX, okay? And then this is from a... Uh, this is from a... Uh, uh, this is one I bought from E-Bikezilla. Okay, so the, the three-bearing one has Sword EM01 on it, okay? The... Okay, the four-bearing model has no markings on it, okay? It just looks... It looks a little bit bigger, for one thing. Yeah, it does look beefy. Yeah, so see? See, that's why this this part flares out here. It's so you can it accommodates one more bearing. So, so, yeah, that's really interesting. I don't know which one I'm going to put back in. Maybe I'll put the four-bearing one on. I kind of messed it up, though. Yeah, I kind of messed it up putting it, taking it apart. This one is harder to take apart because it's got four bearings in it. Um, so I don't really know how to take this one out, guys. This <laughs> is two-bearing one because I messed it up, all right? So just be very careful taking it out. Um, it's probably better to use a puller instead of a press, but, but yeah, like, you know, I don't have a puller that can remove that. So, so yeah, that's, that is really interesting. So, I don't know. Um, since I got this one out, let's just put this one back. We'll put the four bearings. That, that means I have to go freeze another bearing. <laughs> that's what I'm going to say, all right? 